Hello, this is Amanda, and welcome to Connect the Dots. We will be talking about a zodiac which is normally termed as lunatic. But are they really a gone case, or a case gone wrong? The first sign in Western astrology of the zodiac is Aries, the ram. Said to be individuals who think by their head, an Aries decision-making ability is lit by one bulb. Although low on temperament, Aries are individuals who focus on their career and achievements. Usually go-getters and target achievers, these individuals go far in life and have said to have a very fast-paced life. With all the careful planning and stress, this can cause great frustration, especially to the Aries when they don't appear to be achieving their goals on time. These frustrations become easier for the Aries to handle as they evolve and realize some things just take time, or that sometimes they have to throw several more punches or outrightly change the tune to get results. Usually, Aries are bipolar, but that depends on situations and environment. Aries governs the head region, brain, and nervous system. Therefore, Aries are prone to headaches, migraine headaches, neuralgia, mental disorders, and other diseases indicative of the brain region. Arians are strong and enthusiastic, inspirational, zealous, imaginative, inventive, and optimistic. These abilities make them a better entrepreneur, military officer, public relations executive, and media planners. Aries personality traits are extremely useful and they can, if put to proper use, ensure a life full of impressive achievement. If you are born under the sign of the Ram, you should consider yourself blessed. You've got amazing willpower and initiative. There's nothing you can't tackle if you try. You need, though, to watch out for a tendency to create a life full of difficulty, just so that you always have something to sort out. You like living close to the edge, but if you could only manage to stand one step back from it, a lot more of your projects would come to fruition. These factors say a lot about Aries. They are not lunatic, but achievers. Yes, they might have a problem or two, but their individualist ability to face them defines whether they will have a breakdown or not. By these things, it can be said that Aries are not lunatic. I hope we busted your myth regarding Aries. See you next time. Talking about a